Breaking news. APC Kakos demands Bajabi Amila's resignation letter. The coalition of APC Democrats has passed a vote of no confidence on the Speaker of the House of Representatives, Femi Bajabi Amila, consequently demanding his resignation from office. The group said that Bajabi Amila has displayed gross abuse of office and complete disregard for the APC as a party. Speaking at a press conference at a press conference on Friday in Abuja through its national coordinator Kabiru Adamu, it said that the legal lawmakers on all some activities reached at an all time low in recent weeks from pretending to be a nationalist whist at the same time sharing hoodlums during the NSAS protest. The APC group noted that Bajabia Miller has ridiculed the office of the president with his constant bashing and invitations. Instead of synergies synergizing with the executive to deliver on the campaign promises of the APC, the coalition accused the speaker of constantly attacking attaching the policy of federal government. The coalition of Democrats therefore included that Benjamin Miller has lost the party's support and it could be against all forms of morality for him to continue to occupy the office of the Speaker of the House of Representatives. By water. It, however, demand, demanded that the Suriliri one legislature step down for a loyal members of the APC to assume the position in the interest of the party and the country. The group further warned its members that it would be no, no longer tolerated or it will no longer tolerate such con from a supposed high ranking member of the party. Thank you viewers for listening to this news. Hmm. Imagine this is bullshit as far as I'm concerned. The rejection of the water bill by the House of Representatives is part of this uh, uh, grudge because he invited the president to come and explain why people are dying like animals in this country. Is that why? <laughs> Imagine. I know APC party would definitely collapse soon. I'm very much sure of that. They will collapse very, very soon. And that should be soon. Soon. Not too long. It will be very, very soon. According to what I will keep saying and what people say, is, they said that Majabia Miller is guilty of being accused. He's guilty of the accusation they leveled against him. Then that is why they have um, asked for his resignation. But we don't know how true that is. To me, this is a very useless talk from useless group. What is bad in inviting the president to come and explain himself or explain how he's managing the security situation in the Nigeria? What is there? Imagine. This appears that some people are happy that Innocent people are being killed on a daily basis. They are happy. But I know that God 
will definitely take vengeance. The Bible says, vengeance is of the Lord. So, don't just not take vengeance in our own hands. God will take vengeance. That is it. God will take vengeance. That is it. So, for standing for the truth, it is those animals, those animals and criminals who are if after their own pockets alone, they want the country to go down. They are the ones that are right and call themselves not a senseless set of people, senseless carcass who are deceiving themselves. But they never knew that they, that they are deceiving themselves. Imagine. They sit down and think because they are not even thinking at all. They are thinking enough so they should sit down and think of their lives and stop all these stupid thoughts they have been having. You can imagine. They are all useless. They are not even useful. They are cowards. And they are still stupid. So, they are the cockles that are organizing, or they are, they are the cockles that are really planning evil. Abi, these people are fools. They are useless people who does not want the good of Nigeria. They don't. They don't want to even support, they don't want to call it, first, they don't even support others and the innocent ones. I know that God Almighty will disappoint and disgrace them very soon. God is just a patient God. When the time comes, then you see what God will do to them if they refuse to repent. So, they either like the way people are suffering and struggling to eat and survive, then they will definitely see the ass in future. God will definitely deal with them. We deal with all of those useless, senseless people calling themselves cacos to hell with them. I don't care about them. Nobody cares about them. They, 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 it's their mouth. They, have the, they can say any, can vomit any rubbish out of their mouth. I think this must be a joke. It must be a joke. If he's throwing the line of the masses, then it is very bad. It's very, very bad of him. They want him to be executive storage. Are you people stupid? But Jabi Amila, you were there for Nigerian and not a PC. Carry on on your assignment with no fear of God. You don't, you don't fear, have fear for God and the masses. This is why they are saying all of this about you. But if you keep believing that God exists and take God close to your heart, then forget it. Forget it. You will always be supported. God will definitely allow that. God will definitely revenge for you. So viewers, you've heard it all. What is your take on this news? Your comment concerning this is very much important. Don't hesitate to drop every of your comments down below the comment box. Click on the subscription button as well as the bell button to get more updates whenever we upload new videos. Thank you as you do. Have a wonderful day. Bye.